All right, top of the morning, or actually top of the afternoon now, half past two. Uh, haven't filmed this morning just because I was in a bit of a rush. Morning routine took a bit longer today for some reason. But we're out here, I got myself some chicken, got my book. I'm gonna read for a bit now out in the sun, get my sun tanning done. Um, not much happened at uni today, like, ah, this chair is hot. Literally just got to uni, sat upstairs, played some table tennis, and then got into classes right away. Classes all the way up to the end of the day. We did have a little coffee break in between, obviously. But I'm back home now, and I've got no gym today. One thing I also realized with my gym progress, I made the most progress last year when I was doing a four day split. Like the most muscle growth I saw when I was when I had a few break days from weightlifting. And then I started doing it every single day and my progress kind of went like that. So now that I'm doing a four day split again, it's gonna be interesting to see how it changes things. And obviously the days in between, I'm not gonna be doing nothing. I'm gonna be doing boxing. Uh, in fact, tomorrow tomorrow morning, I'm going to go check out this boxing gym down the road. Well, in Claremont, and I'm going to go see what, what it's all about there. Just kind of get a feel for it. There's, I have two gyms in mind, and I want to check them both out this week. And then hopefully by next week, I'll be able to choose a, a, a boxing gym and go from there. But either way, I'm deviating from my point. Having a few rest days now in between is gonna, is gonna be good because also it means I can push myself harder on the days I do go into gym. So yeah, it's gonna be interesting to gauge the pro progress from that. Otherwise, I'm out here, I've got my chicken for lunch, got my book, gonna get my sun tanning done. It's half past two now, so I've got about an hour and then I'm gonna get to work, see if I can book a bunch of calls. The sun is very nice. But I wanna book more calls than yesterday because yesterday I only booked two calls, which is not, it's not fantastic. So obviously I'd like to get a little more done today. So we've got to get locked in. Okay, there we go. A bit of sun tanning is done now. I've still got half an hour, so I think I'll just carry on reading inside and then get to work in about half an hour. I really, really want to get like three, four calls booked today. That would be fantastic. So I've got to lock in, I've got to focus even more than I usually do. So, yeah. Oi, oi. <laughs> I miss saying that. Uh, just a quick update for you guys. Let me close this. I booked a call so far today, so that's good. I usually don't book calls in the afternoon because that's when people come online. There's just lots and lots of conversations. But yeah, we got one call booked this afternoon. I did a little bit more reading, but now I'm sitting here, I've got my dinner, it's like, couscous and lamb curry it's nice but yeah let's have a look at the comments from yesterday's video looking good bro keep it up channel's growing nicely thank you i'm actually looking pretty good <laughs> uh i don't think the channel's grown much like over the past few days it's kind of gone like that that's probably just because the video quality hasn't been insane do you guys think I should maybe put some more effort into editing these videos? Like have maybe some background music and, and transitions and better thumbnails, like edited thumbnails. Let me know if you guys think that would be good or if it would improve or anything like that. You are becoming a wise young man. I hope so, I hope so. 1K loading, you've been popping off brother. Yeah, 1K soon. I reckon I'll hit 1K by the end of the week, probably if not Monday, so let's hope. Awesome, my guy. <laughs> there was a time before smartphones. It did give us more time to think and also more time talking face-to-face -face with friends, etc. Somehow we managed to get through daily life, not connected every minute to the whole world and the whole world not connected to us. Yeah, honestly, I, I could sit here and complain and say, oh, I wish I was born in a different generation. And obviously, having phones and social media has its benefits and it has its negatives but there's nothing i can do about it. there's nothing we can do about it this is the age we live in we just have to adapt sitting in the sun is good for your health vitamin d 15 minutes a day will help instead of having to take supplements absolutely and it's also just good for your happiness levels like 
I've noticed I've just been happier from sitting in the sun. And for guys, it's good for your testosterone. So it being in the sun is very good for your testosterone. Plus it makes you look better. Great show, you, great show, you're looking better. I love to walk every day in the morning. From, I still don't know where PA is. Is it Pennsylvania? I got a comment the other day and I've already forgotten. I'm pretty sure PA is Pennsylvania. But yeah, walking's awesome. I'm glad to see you're back in the game. You know it. Teach us, your European, your European friends, how to make a cut without losing muscle, please, buddy. Okay, so there's a lot more, a lot of other people who are more qualified to talk about this than me. So take this, this advice with a pinch of salt. When it comes to cutting and not wanting to lose too much muscle, it's obviously just about being in a slight deficit. Like if you go in a very intense deficit, anything more than 300 calories, I'd say, then you'll start losing muscle. But if, it, if it's, if you're on a 200, 150 calorie uh, deficit, then you shouldn't lose too much muscle. And also just make sure that most of it is protein. Like just get more protein in than usual and you shouldn't lose muscle. And then obviously, things like caffeine will help so you can go harder in the gym and because usually well sometimes on a cut you can lose quite a lot of energy and in a gym your your lifts will suffer so you, that could be a way of losing muscle so if you stay caffeinated you eat a lot more protein and you're in a slight deficit you shouldn't lose too much muscle but yeah anything over 300 calories i think you'll start losing muscle from but like i said i'm not a qualified nutrition or fitness expert nor do I have a great physique yet. So take the information with a pinch of salt. Yeah, there we go. That's that's all the comments from yesterday's video. You guys can let me know what you think about that little suggestion about better thumbnails, more edited, better titles for the video. And then obviously with the video itself, maybe having music in the background, more editing transitions, that sort of stuff. Obviously it'll take more time, but hey, if it's gonna grow the channel, I'm willing to put in more work. But yeah, I'm gonna eat my dinner now and then get back to work. See if I can book two more calls. Two more calls, I think it's doable depending on, the, depending on how active the inbox is. But yeah, I'll check in with you guys later. And there we have it. Whoa, hair is messy. Day is done. Finished with three calls booked, so I'm happy with that. <clears throat> My voice is getting weird. <clears throat> Anyways, I'm going to wrap up the video now. Tomorrow morning is, I don't have uni tomorrow, which is nice. I don't have uni on Thursday either because it's a public holiday here in South Africa. I'm not sure which, which one it is, but yeah. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to go check out Boxing Gym over in Claremont. So I'm looking forward to that. Anyway, see you guys tomorrow. You guys can go like and subscribe, comment, follow me on Instagram.